If you're looking for a hosting company to deploy your applications that make it super simple for you to get up and running, start building your software as a service, your static sites, your portfolios, guys, this is the one for you guys. I want to introduce you guys to Savala. I want to start this off by saying, guys, I'm not getting paid by Savala. And Savala, if you're watching, shoot, you want to throw me a sponsor video? Go ahead. I love this product, right? Now, this company is new, right? But it's not really new right? To be honest with you, this is owned by the company Kingsta. And for those that don't know who Kingsta is, well, Kingsta is the best hosting platform when it comes to WordPress. And they basically have like the fastest servers. Like I've never seen a WordPress website run fast other than in Kingsta. Now they have this new company, Savala, which allows you to deploy pretty much any type of application. We're talking about PHP Laravel, Node.js, Next.js, um, you know, Flask, Shoe, you could pretty much deploy anything that you could think of, right? Any type of stack, they pretty much can go in and handle it and make it very, very simple. All you need is just Git. That's it. You don't have to be worrying about setting up servers. You don't have to worry about nothing. You come in, you have your project, you go in, you push your changes, and guess what? You get to have your website up and running. Me personally, guys, I'm not a DevOps guy. I don't want to be doing no IT work. I don't want to be doing no cloud setup, no AWS. I don't want to do none of that. I just want to code and I want to get my applications up and running. For those of you guys that don't know, I've been working on this new website called entryleveljobs.ai and it's built on Laravel and we're using also to Vue.js for the front end. But again, the website is almost ready to launch and I was looking for a better hosting. I was working with another company and I said, eh, this thing is not working out. I need to find something better. And luckily I found this company. Again, I'm telling you guys about this, not because I'm like shilling or I know this company. I don't know them from a hole in the wall, but if they want to give me a back, I'm going to take it. Now, again, I'm sharing it because this is the best experience that I've had for setting up, especially a PHP Laravel application to be honest with you. Now, let's talk about the things that I love. This is big for me, unlimited users. So let's say you have an application, you can actually go in and have your whole team and you don't have to pay per seat, meaning that I could have four or five guys working on my applications and I don't have to go in and pay an extra $20 for each one of them because it starts adding up. And sometimes some companies, they go in, depending on how much resources you have, they might go in and start charging you per person that it's on the team, which is ridiculous. Okay. You have unlimited resources that you can use. So there is no caps. You can grow as big as you want. Unlimited free traffic. Okay. This is between the connections between the applications and the database unlimited parallel builds, which allow you to go in and spin up a staging and a deployment at the same time, if you wanted to do something like that. And also to you have unlimited database usage. So they're not limiting you on anything. Then you have, of course, a live web terminal where you could just go in into your server, run your commands. You have live runtime logs, so you can debug your application if it's in production and there's some type of issue. Uh, background workers and cron jobs. You also have persistent disk for stateful applications. So let's say, for example, you want to go in and have a static database, right? Or maybe you have like static files, maybe some images, some videos, etc. Like you can literally go in, spin up a, a disk and you can have that within your application where you can just go in and have all of your files in there. Super simple. Now you can also go in and set this up with auto scaling, meaning that, Hey, right now you have an application where nobody's going there, right? You are just working on the development of it. Guess what? You only pay five bucks, super cheap, but you can always grow again. From there, you could go from S1 to S2, S3, right? And this is like vertically scaling, but you can also do horizontal scaling. So meaning that I could start with a S1 and we could start very small and we could say, hey, I want to set this up with uh, auto scaling. And then from there, we could spin up other different instances depending on how much I need to scale. And you can set this up automatically. So again, I love this, right? Because I don't have to go in and call my DevOps guy, or I have to go in there and be constantly monitoring the freaking servers. I don't want to deal with that. I just want to code <laughs> again. Another thing that I really like is hibernation mode. So 
this is really good when you have an application that is based in a specific location and most of your customers are there. So for example, you have a store where most people buy is from the United States. Guess what? When it's like two o'clock, three o'clock in the morning, four o'clock in the morning, seven o'clock in the morning, nobody's buying, nobody's going to your website. Guess what? This automatically goes in and slows everything down. So you're not wasting resources, okay? And then once it gets the first request, then from there, it spins up the application and everything else with it. So again, this saves you money. Now, a lot of other uh, companies do this because this is how they make their bread. They don't want to go in and have you shut down everything when you don't have traffic. They want you to be spending the whole 24 hours. So again, shout out to Svela, right? Or Savella, <laughs> Savella <laughs> or Savala. How However you say right it doesn't matter right so this is the dashboard this is how it looks okay uh when you sign up you have your applications here and your main uh dashboard you could add different services you want to add a static site application a database uh, again you could also go through here see the different static sites again you can start for free with static sites you also have your applications right here um, you also have your databases right here so again this is pretty cool now let me show you guys this right how this looks under the hood okay you have a lot of cool things that that come with this also so for example i didn't get to mention this but cloudflare it's already enabled for you so you can go in and set up for ddos protection cdn right you could do edge caching if that's something that you want to do so yes this is something that again you will have to set up yourself but they already provide you with all of that okay you don't have to go in and be like man let me set up my cloudflare let me set up this and that bro everything is already there for you okay again you have your deployments your analytics information in here about um you know just the requests and everything that's coming in you have your environment variables very easy to set up you have your processes again if you have a web process which is like your web server you could see it right here uh, again this is for this application you can have everything connected so you could have your background workers right here your cron jobs all of your different things that you might want you also have your domains i'm not going to show you that you have your networking you also have your disk like like I said, you can go in and open up some type of uh, disk if you want to go in and have persistent storage, again, for images and things like that. Uh, you also have a web terminal. I could easily go in, uh, PHP artisan, right? Same thing as if I was in my local terminal. All right. So you always have access to this. So if something happens and you're like traveling somewhere and you got to log in on your phone, hey, you could just do this right through here. Now, like I said, guys, I really love Savala. I really enjoy it. Right. It's a very good, smooth experience for setting up your applications. I'm switching over all of my applications to Savala for sure, just because I love it that much. And it just seems so simple and easy for me to work with my team. So I definitely recommend it to you guys. Now, again, you could just go to Savala.com if you guys want to do it. I'm going to put a link below. As you can see, there's no affiliate code. Maybe in the future, if they have an affiliate, hey, throw me a bag. Why not? Okay. But I just share it because I really love the service. And I think that for those of you guys that are creating software as a service, creating uh, web applications, maybe your portfolio, your static websites, this is a great option for you guys. And it's pretty much affordable because there's no gotchas. That's the thing that I like about it, right? This is not like other services. I'm not saying no names. Y'all know who I'm talking about. But you're not going to go in there and you're going to have like, hey, I signed up for a very basic thing. And next thing you know, resources are being eaten up. And now I have to go in and put $50,000, $100,000. I, I just got a bill. That happens in other places. I'm not saying no names, but it does happen. We've seen those stories. So um, again, I like the no gotchas, the, hey, well, you're not paying per seat. I could have a team of 20 people if I wanted to working on my applications and I'm paying the exact same price. I'm not paying extra just because I gave somebody an extra username. You get what I'm saying? Like, that's crazy, right? But yeah, that's why I like Savala. So definitely go check it out. Now, guys, for anybody that's in here, okay, just in case you guys forgot, we are having a 50% off sale on codingphase.com, okay? It's still there. 
Everything on the platform, 50% off. It's a Black Friday sale. We ran it basically for this whole week. And now we're still giving you another week. Okay. We will be announcing the winner on Friday of the brand new MacBook. So when you come in and you sign up to Coding Face, either a Diamond member for six months or yearly, or you sign up for the lifetime membership, right? You get to be entered into the chance of winning a brand new MacBook. So if you want that chance, definitely come through. And if you want the services that we provide, okay, we give you access to all of our courses, tech accelerator program, 12 hours of group coaching, right? Different career paths to help you master all of web development. The goal is to teach you how to go from zero, okay? And in a month, start being able to start applying to jobs to then a year later, right? Have that whole journey that you did on Coding Face and become a content editor, an email developer, learn front-end development with Shopify, learn how to do full-stack applications, learn how to actually make money online independently with the skills that you have, right? So that whole year that you're with us or that six months, you're going to leave with real skills that you could actually make money with, okay? And by the way, go check out the Profitable Developer course. All of you guys that are already Diamond members, that's the course where I'm laying out the whole game plan. I'm teaching you guys every single thing that I know from 2011 till this day of today. I don't know. You're watching this in 2024. You're watching in 2025, 2026. I don't know. But that's the course that's going to go in and cover how to make money online as a developer. And I'm giving you the whole strategy, everything that I use for my own business. When you see me here on YouTube and you see we have a platform, that platform generates income. I'm teaching you exactly how I do that myself. You can do it as a content editor. You could do it as a front end developer. You could do it as a full stack developer. Developer. It doesn't matter what level you're at, the skills that you do have, you can monetize them. Okay. Again, come through, come check out Coding Face. Take care, guys.